Alright. Is Rechain boring? Um... Not really. It's like... It's kind of fun, but the game is really difficult. Alright, let's go take on the, um, secret episode boss. If that leads me to it. Could we watch the recording? I don't know. Let you know what, maybe I'll make a, a pull out of it first. nervous about this fight so there's gonna be a, like a lot of fails I guess defeat the enemy I kind of dodged that.
There we go. First attempt and I defeated that boss. Oh man. If that was if that was the entire boss fight. Hey look, there's bushes and trees. Fragmentary Passage Birth by Sleep, Volume 2 Alright, yeah, I played this on proud mode, I completed, ooh, I got the last chapter completed, 70% archive completed, defeated 5,100 enemies, I used Kiraga like 200 times, I used the Spellweaver 26 times, I used Aqua's dealing 2 times, and my total playtime is 29 hours, 45 minutes, and 15 seconds. Awesome. I'm gonna save the secret episode. And then there's another episode. Super secret episode. <laughs> not just kidding, not really. There we go. Okay, so I guess that was the secret episode. I was expecting this to be a lot more difficult, but yeah. I'm not going to stop the stream very soon, but I don't know if I really want to stream the recoded movie or the uh, do more or just level up like, you know, the three characters up to level 99. So, tell you what, let me go make a um straw pour or something and let all of you decide. Because I was going to do the um, post-game stuff for Birth by Sleep by leveling up like Ventus, Terra, and Aqua to um, to level 99 so I can get ready for the um, secret bosses, but we'll see. Alright, I have it up, so let me go post this on Twitter as well.
And while it's voting, I'll just like browse around some of the um, Trinity archives. You're in the Trinity Trophy for finishing all the stories in proud mode or above. Awesome. Alright. Trophies I unlocked in this game. Proofy have finished all the stories in proud mode or above. Nice. Proofy have finished one character's story. Yeah, I don't have the other six trophies. As for the secret reports, I do have all twelve reports plus the letter. Fragmentary passage. Blank points where the heart goes. Final episode. Terra Ventus and that's for the timeline. So it seems like Terra went to the Enchanted Dominion first. And it makes me wonder how long have Ventus and Aqua been doing between the land of departure and the first row they visited in their progress. Oh well. Alright, let me see. Wow, it's a 50 50 vote. One vote to stream the recoded movie, and one vote to level up Ventus, Terra, and Aqua to level 99 for the preparation for secret bosses. Tower, Badlands, Radiant Garden, Disney Town, um, Olympus Coliseum, then there was Deep Space, then Neverland, and then there was the Mysterious Tower, and then Destiny Islands, then the Badlands, Land Departure, Destiny Islands, um, Then the Keyblade Graveyard, and then the final and the secret episode. And then that was it. Okay, so... Tell you what. I'm gonna stop the stream. Hold on, let me type it in the chat. So yeah, I'm going to stop the stream for a little bit because I don't want to like stream just the title screen for nothing. So yeah, um, please share the um, straw poll link to wherever you usually, usually share it and then, you know, I'll decide if I'm going to stream more Birth by Sleep or stream the recoded movie. So yeah, um, no. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go take a break, and then I will just see you all in in a bit to see which one I'm going to do. So yeah, I'll see you in like a few minutes or something. So.